teacher here at the West. And welcome to our West Somerville Neighborhood School Winter Concert. Say woo! <laughs> We're super excited. Wherever you're watching from, thank you for tuning in. Keep in mind, if you can't watch the whole thing, you can't stay. It will be saved, so you can watch it later. We're super excited. We're going to open up with the pre-K group. They have two songs that they're going to sing for you all. So wherever you are, give it up for pre-K. And we have Mr. D and Ms. Dowling that help us out. All right, thank you so much. You guys ready? All right. One, a two, a one, two, Logan, go.
solos. Thank you, pre-K. Next up, we have kindergarten. Now, we have two groups of these kindergartners coming here, up here to sing for you all. We have two really joyful pieces, Dance Like Snowflakes, and This is the Light of Mine. We're gonna come on up and find their spots. Welcome, kindergarten. All right, are you ready?
kindergarten. That was an amazing job. Pop it up again for kindergarten. Our soloists were Nava and Dana. Pop it up for them. Amazing work. All right. We are going to head out. I'll have the first throw fall that white line down to your teachers. They first row first. Second row. Keep on. 
classic. Frosty the Snowman, give it up for the second grade.
when they played one. Does anyone know? Anyone know what song that was? Yes, Addy? Uh, baby, baby Shark. That's a classic. Okay. Good job, guys. You're free to pass out. Awesome. Okay. Next up, we have the fifth grade band going to perform Jingle Bells. Okay. All right, give it up for fifth grade band. One, two, three, four.
of Miss Sears. All right, give it up for a sixth grade band.
Busters. Give it up for the band. Under the direction of Miss Sears and Mr. Babzinski. All right, give it up for the band. <laughs> holiday break and so all the students are out except for the WSNS flag football and basketball players. They have just finished practice and are heading to the locker rooms so they can change and leave for break. Come on guys, move too slow. Let's be real. Hey, that's hard. It's not even dead. Really
Meanwhile, in the girls' locker room. All right, all right, it's time, break time. Hello, dance with me. Chloe, if you know. Sorry, I totally forgot that Chloe going around. 60, please. I right, we're with Chloe. Yeah, we're all ready for vacation to start. Two weeks and no math. Two weeks and no kahoot. Two weeks and no A large crash is heard. Stud students are frightened. Both groups run to the locker rooms and look around. What a tornado was that? While the students stand in confusion, three other loud bangs are heard. They are scared and begin to wonder and proceed to panic. I know we're scared. I'm too, but we need to find out where the bangs are. I agree. Let's go the girls The students split up and come to find out that every exit has an avalanche of snow covering it. They are completely snowed in with no adult in sight and meet by Miss Barris's office. Outside of Miss Barris's office. So. smaller groups and spread it across the entire school to find a solution. They are frantic, nervous, and completely losing their marbles. All students are desperately trying to open each exit. Unfortunately, even with all their efforts, the doors refuse to open. We have tried everything! Yeah, let's open up these doors. I'm the trunk is here and I can't open them. Oh yeah, I'm the trunk is here and I'm this close to opening up. Guys, we should just give up on our door and call it a good kid. Room. Yes, it is I. You can call me your majesty, actually. How did you get in here? Look up. Huh? Do you ever need to open that in the music room? Did you call out of that thing? I sure did. But how do you go to the chat? Yeah, I wouldn't go back to the school. Well, I sense danger, so I followed into my gut and led me to you guys. Now it's time to get out of here. Yeah, you can say that again. You know, guys, you're really gonna miss y'all. Yeah, you weren't so bad after all. No, nothing to stop me, this guy. They all traveled through the mysterious tunnel in, in the music room and found their way home to enjoy a peaceful holiday break. Hey guys! Where did everybody go? I just got back from the bathroom. It is a prank.
Now, the other six grade about to come up, Mr. Whitney's class. They worked on this holiday skit, they added some music into it, thought of the idea, thought of what we could change, and they brought the life to it. This class, they had their own character, little traits they added, their own props they brought. We had an awesome director, Rowan, and we had an assistant director, Sebastian, who helped out. We have great musicians, we have Abby, we have Yoan on the drums, they both drumming. We have our stage crew, the scene who would help out, the stage crew. We planned this whole thing out, we performed it about probably say a month ago in our dress rehearsal, and now we're doing it again for the concert, all right? They've been working so hard on this skit, practicing, working on their lines. They really came up their shells with this, with this, and I'm really proud of them. So, are you guys ready to rock and roll? So don't forget to project, have fun, welcome again, Mr. Winnie's class. Give it up, give it up. Woo! It's the holiday winter break for the students at the WSNS. Anastasia and Alec are rushing to an exchange students and each have invited a friend to spend holiday break back with them in their hometown. The scene opens on the plane, and all four students are deep asleep with headphones on. The students begin to wake up, stretch, and get ready to exit the plane. outside of the airport and quickly realize that they are not in Russia and they quickly begin to panic. What in the world? Um, Alec, this does not look like home to me. I mean, I was going to say anything, but it's usually not 100 degrees in Russia. I'm unable to reach home. However, I just spoke to the front desk and came to find out we're in Australia. How could that be? We're supposed to be in Russia. There was an issue with the flight. The next flight out was so we are stranded here on Christmas Eve. What are we gonna do? Where are we gonna stay? What are we gonna eat? Because I am hungry. I don't know, but I am scared. We have a full day in Australia. What are we gonna do? A group of Australian students overhear the WSNS complaining and kindly walk over to greet them. Boy, mates, did I hear Russia? You're in the great outback. Welcome. I mean, how could you Yeah, man. 
The gang splits up and goes on various missions around Australia. The audio made the students feel welcome. Now let's see how their mission goes. absolute blast and the time is now 10 p.m. and it's time to head back to the airport to send the, the WSNS off on their way.
our seventh and eighth grade chorus. Can we clap for them? Give them some support. Give them some support. Show them some love. Pat, 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 pat. You know, it's been a fine two years, guys. They have not been singing on a stage with all that's going on. So we're happy to be back and we're excited. They're gonna sing their hearts out. We have two pieces. The first song is Rise Up, the second song is Lean On Me. So if you guys want to clap for that song, if you want to have fun with that song, please, please help us out, all right? Um, so I'm going to go ahead. We have our soloists for the first song. On these lovely four up here, we have Jewel, Jules, we have Julia, not to Julia, too. you love it. We have Adina, and we have Mahali for the first solos. The second song, we have McCartney and Riley on those solos. Clap for them. Keep it here. Hallelujah. You hear my voice? I can't hear you from down here. Has to be up here. Okay, you ready? <laughs>
First off, Miss Hood and Miss Baker, who has, they, listen, I tell them I have an idea. They're like, you know what, let's do it. They have been so supportive to me as anything that I want to do, they're, they're right there. I'm so thankful for them. My support staff, um, Leanne King, Miss Barrows, um, Miss Morris, I have Miss Chambers helping me today. It was so helpful having you guys support me with the students. My teachers, my Wolfpack game staff, thank you guys so much for bringing the kids in. It flowed. It's, so, it's a little bit past 12, but we flowed. We were right on time now. Okay, and I'm so proud of that. It was, you guys did an amazing job. I'm so thankful for you. Thankful, thanks to all my specialist staff, my specialist team who are working with me. Like, you know, we, we need these kids here. They help me out. We need this rehearsal here. Thank you to the musicians, the teachers, the instructors, Mr. Brzezinski, Ms. Sears, Ms. Sadler, um, those who can be here today, thank you guys as well. Um, I'm just so grateful. And thank you to all the parents who support me and who've been there sending encouraging words. I mean, all your emails I have a million to go through, so if I get back to you, I'll get back to you. <laughs> but thank you to all the parents who've been so amazing and warm. I'm thankful to be here, and I think that's all. I hope I didn't miss anybody. I wanted to give it from my heart because I really want you guys to understand that me, it means a lot to me that all of you did a great job and tried your, your best to do this. And kids stepped out of their shells. They were scared because they said, you know what, I'm gonna sing, I'm gonna perform. And I'm just so proud. I could talk all day. So we're gonna end it here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Feel free to watch this later. If you can't watch the whole thing, I totally get it. It was a long concert. Thank you so much. And Miss Miss Altenor, and I'm out. <laughs> Thank you guys. I can't breathe. Nobody said, hold on. Thank you, Tamara Curry, you guys are awesome. <laughs> Thank you, Joe, I appreciate you.